Dali reacts to Sasa Grant cancellation. El Dali reacts to Sasa Grant cancellation. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dr. John Swainer TV. Please subscribe. The country is two months into the new year and the date for the 2024 elections is yet to be confirmed. Several political parties have pledged to end crime, increase job opportunities and improve the education system. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dr. John Swainer TV. Please subscribe. But the topic of the South African Social Security Agency, SASA, remains controversial in keeping many gogos and madalas on the edge, especially when there is news that the older persons grant could possibly be scrapped. In January, President Cyril Ramaphosa made headlines when he reportedly warned that should the ANC fail to attain the majority vote, the National Student Financial Aid Scheme NSFAS, and the Social Grant could be scrapped. He was speaking in Bombay, Lampo, Malanga on Monday, 8 January, where the party celebrated its 112th birthday in the lead up to its January 8 statement. This statement sparked the fear in many elderly people who fall under the 47% of South Africans who rely on monthly social grants. Many beneficiaries like Rosenlovo 64 from Soweto were shocked by this and claimed that politicians were using Sasa as a weapon against them. This is the very same money we use to support our grandchildren who depend on us for everything. If they decide to take it, hunger will kill us. What they are doing is wrong because this money doesn't belong to the ANC and whoever sits in power will allow Sasa to continue. They must stop this thing of using it as a weapon, she said. Rose was not the only one who was angered by this. Frail Miriam Zulu, 88, who uses crutches to walk, said they needed this money to live. We need this money to survive. Without it, we will suffer, she said. Boy Kima Pila, 55, another beneficiary, said such a statement were the reason many people clung on to the ANC and feared change. He said this was because they didn't know which dark hole they would be throwing themselves in. They are now blackmailing us. We have to constantly live in fear. This is why we find ourselves hanging on the ANC because we have a fear that should they leave, all of Sasa will be gone, he said. Someone commented and said they want us to keep them in power so that they can steal, steal monies. Time is up. Let them be voted out. That's just a trick to return to power. Another one commented and said, Sis Rama, you have dignity by threatening people for votes. You should be ashamed of yourself. You and your ANC are rotten. Another one commented and said, Sasa comes from the state, not any political party. Fear not. Another one commented and said, People let go out there and teach our people because of poverty in our people ANC is taking advantage the grant money is not from ANC is from taxpayers even ANC is getting pay from taxpayers another one commented and said the uh, you liar Sasa grants are paid to all South Africans irrespective of color another one commented and said he is talking nonsense this is not ANC money they are not uh, 
is dollars. Another one commented and said the ANC rules because of the voters. They make bad choices. Another one commented and said we should vote the ANC out of power. Another one commented and said why is Sasa Grants only getting paid to the black population as I am not working at all either now as I am a white pensioner why can't I also not claim social grants as well too is because of the amount of money you have or how does it work another one commented and said the people seem to take and believe everything sasa grant not going anywhere another one commented and said the sasa grant funds do not belong to the ruling government the funds belong to the south african people irrespective of race sasa grants will never be cancelled if a new political party is voted into power and possibly even increased if no skimming of the top is taken like the uncaring merciless and thieves who don't care in the least about the population of south africa another one commented and said let them scrap it before voting date we will show them flames on ballot paper like last term they did not get majority of votes this time anc will see flames if they take away sasa grant we will vote for a party that has public interest at heart not only their stomachs and families another one commented and said the elderly have worked all the years so they deserve it that comes from the state not political party so stop playing games with the elderly ladies and gentlemen my name is dr john swina tv please subscribe bye, -bye for now till we meet again next time subscribe